Zonich's point came back to him. He's dragged down. McKernan tries to get a Houlihan. Knocked away by Fox. Houlihan gets through. Goes with the outside of the boot and kicks a goal. Well, if you to describe that one, Gary actually brought the ball down and gave a little well done when he did it. He brought the ball down, held on to it, and he takes two tacklers. Corey McKernan just puts it over the top, sort of nondescript, but Houlihan was able to read it. And somehow, amongst about five Hawthorne defenders, there was a path through for it. Made a bit of a blue Adrian Cox then. Just yep. tried to be a little bit cute by tabbing it to himself. In that situation, just... Forward of the wing, spots a man running into space. Houlihan, he can take it and go. Well, he stumbled. He certainly was flirting with the idea, should I, shouldn't I? He slammed the brakes on, but given half a chance, he would have scampered. I've got to say, Shane Crawford, on that occasion, we sung his praises, well, all year, really, but he allowed Houlihan to run past him, and just a touch of, I'd say, arrogance. Yep. I think he backed in his teammates Team to win 50-50, yeah. so he could have been heading back the other way. He didn't, and it was too late once he realised Houlihan had to jump on him, so... Just a little touch of um, cockiness sneaking into this Hawthorne team. Eccles, 12 possessions. I just get the feeling they've defined his role a little better tonight. And as a result, on the end of it, Houlihan kicks the goal. He's got two. Certainly talented. Well, for all the talk, they're back within three goals, the Blues. Yep. And they've worked their way into it. Just They get in their goals forward of the play. Like somebody will get themselves free of the play like that one. And they've had to take that little bit of risk element and run forward because there's nobody at the in the forward. To McKernan. McKernan forward of half back. High ball down towards half forward. Big pack again. Whitnell almost directed it down. Hurahan. No one inside the Clever. forward 50. How will it run? It's going towards the line. Oh. What a clever kick. He just rolled it end over end, Gary, and it was always going to run on an extra 40 metres. It was a beauty, Doom. It sums up just how quickly that kid's football brain works and ticks over. He had a look, saw that there was nothing on. He knew he couldn't outrun the hay. No, he's a smart player. Oh. That's stiff. Very unlucky. Eighth possession for Simon Beaumont to half forward. Out comes Hotton. Bullahan has been explosive. Hugging the boundary line. He runs himself 50. He has a shot at the goal. And he's kicked it. He's kicked his side. Third from the corner. And Carl the back in the MCT. Well, Adrian Cox is playing on Houlihan. He's been a creative backman. And Houlihan's exploiting that now. Houlihan's getting goal side of Cox. And I wouldn't... Yeah, well, there you go. Adrian Cox has been dragged as we speak. He's just... He's played himself into form, Adrian Cox, and he's just let Houlihan go, and he's punishing him now. Well, Cox is paying the price for it. Don't underestimate the finish either. He, he's got great composure, yep. and I think he's got great belief in his ability, Dermot, which is a wonderful thing to have when you're still just starting out in this caper chance. Bateman is his new opponent. He's kicked three for the quarter. Lance has got one as well.